Hello everybody, it's that time of day again. It's story time. I've got my frumpy reading sweater on. And oh, what do we got to drink today? Mm. A nice cup of coffee. Okay, we need a book. I'll get a book. Hold on a moment. Okay, I need some reading glasses. And today's story is called Nutcracker Noel by Kate McMullen. Well, let's see how it goes. <coughs> Excuse me. Noel dreamed of dancing in a real ballet. So when Miss Olga swept into the studio one day saying that everybody was going to get a part in the Nutcracker, Noelle believed her dream was coming true. After class, Miss Olga clapped for attention. This year, my assistant, Miss Crystal, will be the Snow Queen. Nikki and Parker will be mice. Elizabeth will be a marzipan doll. And Maya will be a gingerbread cookie doll. Miss Olga looked at her list. Noel will be a tree. When she heard the news, Maya's mother smothered Maya with kisses. My little cookie doll, she exclaimed. Noel felt sick to her stomach. At the first rehearsal, Noel counted seven other trees. Not one of them was smiling. Across the room, the mice and dolls laughed and played tag using the piano for a bass. Noel scampered over and got into the game. When Miss Crystal asked the dolls to sit, Noel sat right down. You're not a doll, Mia said loudly. Aren't you a tree, said Miss Crystal. Nice try, said Parker, as Noel trudged off. Miss Olga handed out wooden spoons. Pretend these are candles, she said. The trees sh shushed on tiptoe while Miss Olga counted. One, two, three. Two, two, three. Noelle's feet began to hurt. Second to last tree, said Miss Olga. Stay with the counts. Meanwhile, Miss Crystal showed the dolls how to twirl. Mia twirled like a top. She whirled like a tornado and fell down. Wah, wailed Mia. My ankle. Mia's mother burst through the door. Precious cookiekins, she cried. Noel cut out of line. I'll take Mia's place. Mia hopped up. Don't worry, everybody. I'm all right. Parents out, shouted Miss Olga. Second to last tree, back in line. After rehearsal, Noel, Noel knocked on Miss Olga's dressing room door. Please, could you change me to be a doll? You think I'm a magician, said Miss Olga. Ha! In my first ballet, I was a toadstool. No one who saw me has ever forgotten the way I fluttered my cap. All the way home, Noel tried to imagine how it must feel to be green and prickly. At dinner, Noelle refused her chair. I'm a tree, she said. Trees don't sit. I hope trees eat broccoli, said her mother. Noelle fell asleep that night, listening to the tree music tape Miss Olga had given her. She dreamed she was in a deep forest. Now, at rehearsals, Noelle held, held her trunk straight and stayed with the counts. I am a tree. I am a tree, she thought. My branches sway in the wind. She tried never to look at me, Maya, who wouldn't stop twirling and whirling. 
The Saturday before Christmas, everyone reported to the theater. Dress rehearsal was at noon. At eight o'clock, the curtain would go up for the opening night of The Nutcracker. Sorry, the stage door told Maya's mother. Performers only. Nikki and Parker were already in the costume room, playing go fish in their mouse outfits. Noelle saw racks of doll dresses and soldier uniforms, but no tree suits anywhere. The guard appeared at the dressing room door. Anyone here named Maya? Me, squealed Maya. That's me. Trees, called Miss Olga. She led the way to the rack of glittering gowns. What are these? said Noel. Three guesses. Hands up, honey. As Miss Olga slid on her costume, Noel turned into a fir. Fir tree sparkled with snow. Dolls, called Miss Olga. Me first, cried Mia. She stepped into the cookie doll costume. Miss Olga zipped it up and put on the head. Wait a second, Maya's voice sounded far away. My mother won't even know it's me in here. That's showbiz, said Miss Olga. Dress rehearsal began. Parker knocked over a reindeer. The snow machine dumped all the snow at once. The prince split his pants. The littlest soldier threw up. The worst rehearsal ever, declared Miss Olga. The better the show. Noelle found Mia sitting backstage by herself. You are a gingerbread cookie, Noelle whispered. Believe it, and no one who sees you will ever forget your Christmas cookie dance. Dolls and mice, called Miss Olga. Places. Mia put on her cookie, he cookie doll head. I am a cookie, came her faraway voice. From the wings, Noelle peeked at the dolls twirling and whirling. Mia danced deliciously. As the orchestra struck up the tree music, a mist rose from the forest floor. The Snow Queen Crystal leapt onto the stage. Miss Olga handed Noelle her candle. And the second to last tree Shush, shushed out into the forest, adding her light to the night. It wasn't exactly Noelle's dream come true. It was much, much better. The end. My, that was an interesting story, wasn't it? I've never been in a Nutcracker dance before. Have you? Well, that's the end of the story. I hope you have yourself a great day. You take care of one another. Take care of yourself. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay? Bye now.